Hey guys, this is Sakuo-san, and today we are going to play something different, which is episode 1 of Telltale Batman series. <laughs> Basically, episode 1 is free, <laughs> so I decided to download it and then <laughs> play it for you guys. Well, I played a little bit of it. I just had to delete my file because, well, I guess you can... That apparently, if you want to go on a different save, I don't know. I'll try some other time if I ever want to play on my own and not record. <laughs> so, um, yeah. I had to delete the save file, but never mind. So, um, I was playing this on my own, just testing it out instead. I did yellow. Apparently, I took to, I chose yellow because it's a iconic Batman color. But then the other colors look great too. But I just wanted to choose yellow because you know Batman, Bat black and yellow Batman. It's either blue or yellow or red. But then that's the Batman. That, that's not. I don't know why they chose red for Batman. I think that's Lego Batman and Batwoman. Because, yeah, my friend is going to give me a comic that is Bat. That is the Batwoman comic, actually. And, wow, I did some research on her. Batgirl is actually has a red bat symbol on her. And then there's the Lego Batman, which has also a red symbol on him. But then there's the usual Batman that everybody likes, which is either just black completely, or just like black and yellow, and <laughs> but mostly black. Oh yeah, I turned on the subtitles for you. Just want to bring back the iconic yellow, okay? <laughs> Zoo, that's a great joke. <laughs> okay. Here are some controls I'm gonna do right now. E. You know, sometimes my computer pictures, it's okay. It's a very old girl. Girl. Gal. <laughs> Q. 
No, come on, where's the... Come on. Oh, well, now... Oh. I forgot I glitched as soon as... I was supposed to press something there. Never mind. Can handle it. <laughs> Hello, game. Are you okay? Oh, there we go. Shit. Just a little glitchy. It's fine. <laughs> Sometimes it runs smoothly, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know why. The hell I got this got notification, but oh. I'll just ignore it. both hands on my phone. You ask me to move one hand to the mouse. How do, how do I do this for quick time? I have to be really fast, don't I? I'm wearing yellow today, if you didn't notice. Up. Up. This is the first time I've played a real game <laughs> on this channel. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come, come on! Come on! Come on! Oh shit, I missed one. Shift E. Sometimes it doesn't even notice when I press it. I pressed the wrong button. Shift Q. Come on. Oh. Be quick. Up. Oh. oh no. Never mind. 
So hello, cat lady, cat woman. <laughs> Oh wow, I would have died. You know, even if I don't press the button, he still does something. So maybe I wouldn't have died, I don't know. Oh wait, wrong button, sorry. Oh wait, he still does something. <laughs> he still good press goes does what <laughs> he has to do anyway, even if I press the wrong button. What is wrong with this game? <laughs> oh yeah, telltale. Even if you pick something, you still get the same end <laughs> you still get the same thing. You try to save someone, they still end up dying. <laughs> I guess that's why Telltale stopped, because no one actually thought their games was actually making choices, because when you make the choice, apparently in Walking Dead, when you're trying to save someone, uh, I can't remember what the names are, there was one character named Doug, and I don't know why, my game has just froze. Oh, now you work, okay, good. Okay, so pause. Let's let the game rest for a bit. Um, apparently there's this character called Doug, and there's this other female character. You have to save both of them, apparently. So you choose to save, um, apparently that there's this g woman with her dad, and her dad has a heart attack one time. And basically, you don't want him to die, because he will become a zombie. So basically, if you save... Well, what do I do? You can either choose to save the dad, or you kill the dad. But, if you choose to kill the dad, the dad will still die. If you, the dad will still die, of course. But, and if you choose to save the... Okay. My recorder stopped recording for a while. What was I saying? Yeah, the guy still, the, the dad still dies, no matter what you choose, and and then after that, um, so this your, your friend kills him, um, uh, and then after that, because the dad's dead, because your friend killed him, you. Understand why the friend did it, so he didn't turn into a zombie. So you just, you know, it's Kenny. What can you do? You love Kenny. Um. So you guys, and after that, you you have some sort of choice to save this guy Doug, or this guy this girl. Whichever one you choose, the daughter of that dad. <laughs> goes crazy and kills the one that you save later on as sort of like well she just goes crazy I don't know why she did it she just went crazy and then you either take her with you or sh you leave her behind after that that's not if you want to say it's a sort of thing if you just try to save someone in the game they sort of just die anyway I hope that this game is different of course but I can't remember because I saw Cry play this, but I can't remember what he did. And I can't remember the whole story, so yeah. I have two cups now, what do I do? Fuck. I censor him, so I was doing this. So I'm pretty s- Oh, I got the cat scratch already, why? You broke the law. Oh, her this. text is pink. I like that. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. No one else will. 
are the only one who gets the job done. Sounds lonely. He yeah, does the same know. thing. He says that night. even when I'm. I want to click something else with this, um, the town needs protecting and stuff, I accidentally click the middle one, but it's not that battle for choice either, but eh. Oh, at least my game is running smoothly now. Oh shit, I pressed the wrong one, I gotta look what I'm pressing in. Oh, it's That's too right. I have two hands. I can't move that fast, okay? Oh shit. I pressed the another button and it assumed that I pressed that button. Oh well. The keys must be messed up or something. Oh. Oh shit. Okay. Got better at this. I don't I usually play so games like this. But it's fun. So I don't know if I didn't press E. Oh. No, it's okay. The first time I did that too. Sorry, I didn't expect that. Stop like that. I pressed the button. I pressed it. Sometimes when I even do when I do press the button on time, it doesn't register to a freaking computer. E. Did I even click on it? I don't know. Maybe I just got to press it hard enough? I don't know. I gotta clean my, key my keyboard. Maybe that's why. I'll clean my keyboard. I clean my keyboard's on mass. I have to clean it. What? Oh, okay. Um, I got some food. And the last time I ate on camera, I didn't get any bad comments, so I'm gonna be fine, I guess. Uh, it's mukbang, so it's a thing where people eat in front of a camera now. <laughs> I'm just gonna 
hope there's still quick time to then after then I'm eating. You can't see my food, oh, but I'm gonna eat. Sure So basically, I got some pasta, I got some spaghetti bolognese, some chicken, and chicken pancake. Chicken pancake with some cream. This is basically savory pancake. Yeah, I had that that scratch before. Don't don't look at me just like you haven't got it. Why is this frozen again? <laughs> oh, there we go. Step out of the shadows. Oh no. I'm just going to, um... I think I should close some stuff. Let me close some stuff. I can close some stuff, but not that much stuff. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family. If I ever have a pop and book bong, I'll make it proper, but um this is not my office of first mug bong because you can't see the food that I'm eating, you just can see me eating it, so yeah. Time to save the city. Is it fast in time? No, that's in the summer. I'm just checking with my... I'll just have some... I use... I have Muslim viewers, so... If it's fast in time, they probably would have... Would Thank want you. me to eat on camera. Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. I won't have any mukbangs in, ju in when you're... In June, I promise. Oh shit, it froze again. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Too long. I'm just gonna pause it for a bit. I don't know what's wrong with it. But I did close some stuff. I don't know why it's still not um, running properly. Normally, it should. My face just disappear. Close down Spotify. That should help a bit. But then I only have like two minutes more, so yeah. Under Mayor Hell's authority. I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent <coughs> a vote to finally put your foot down. Together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. If only Mr. Wayne. My campaign's largest backer could have heard that applause. Okay, yeah, was... I think it was Spotify that was doing most of the glitching. Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> well, I tee him up and he knocks him down. That's how Mr. Wayne and I do business. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. Is it pronounced Mukbang? I don't know. I'll go look it up on the proper pronunciation. Apparently, it's a Korean word. Or some sort of tradition that you sit down at a table with, with people and eat. 
Now I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost <clears throat> on your way here. And um, oh, I think it is. Yes, but I'll go look it up to see if it's actually true. I make I like to make an entrance. So I made say last time I should tell something about them. I wanted to say a late night job or something, but I think he's gonna think that I'm Batman. Oh, shit. Swain, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. <laughs> with the grease, there are the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and boats to help make Gotham a place for families again. If we're just eating while waiting for the video to save, um, I'm gonna play a bit more and then I'm gonna stop. But a dent in kind. Right. How about, uh, it's a bit late for that one, but it's okay. Put a dent in crime. Hmm? You, it's not half bad. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me. Change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, it can start with a few hands. Hmm? Come on. introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course, I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last night. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. You believe in Dent? We believe in you. After all, Whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. Hmm. I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come on now, Bob. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know, like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat Freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save the city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Harvey Dent is our best shot. Put him in a room with anyone for 15 minutes and that grin will win him over. I'll try to not make him too fixed this time. 
15 minutes yet, Bob. You've still got time. And don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Truly terrible. A tragedy like that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If only that deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe. Uh... Well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you, too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. You can stay, Miss Bell. No, no, it's all right. You can stay. Thanks. Reporters can stay if they want. They need to. They have to write something, this don't they? The <laughs> Otherwise, they won't be able to. Live. <laughs> oh, he's thinking. It's like, what do I write? Nothing happened wow. today. I, I mean, I can copy Going some shit, but I don't want to copy anything. <laughs> Well, not with journalists, basically. If they are anyway, the journalists whatsoever, they have to find something to write about. Just between us, politics bored the hell out of me. Same. <laughs> Too many words. Why else would I pick it? Didn't think you were the type to get his hands dirty. Well, you'd be surprised. Mr. Wayne, you've, you've got something on your collar. Uh, is that blood? It's okay. Yeah. I cut myself shaving. Oh, this? No, it's nothing. Just, uh, cut myself shaving. What? Butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the body. I told him to say politics bored me. I didn't think he would say that. <laughs> Carmine Falcone? Oh well. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. It is doing their job, honestly, reporters. I know some of them are just really mean. What? What can they? What can we do? I mean. And what kind of business do you think he's in? Well, I don't like the ones that have bad things stop you this time. You know, most of them are fake anyway. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. Okay, my sound, my volume, my audio, and my audio and the movement is out of sync, man.
Bruce. Ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. You could have said you can't <laughs> afford flash, it, but that's no a bit nice. My family built this house. It's not for sale. Everything's for sale, Mr. Wayne. And everyone. Just need to find the right currency. Now, mind for I'll talk. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. You're a respectable man, I hear. I don't know. Last time I did it, I had this. Last time I did it, I remember I got shit for it, so I'm not going to do it now. Perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. If it causes me, I don't know, to be honest. When I watch Cry play this, it doesn't matter if you shake his hand or not. You know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. But if you do shake his hand, so you get some hey, shit for it. Right so I'm on. not gonna shake his hand this time. Oh, come on, guys. Bruce. Let's see what happens if I don't do it. You'll be fine out there, honey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... Ah, ah, what did I say? Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But, in my experience, there's the law, and there's the one what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. Unlike most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. He's trying to make Gotham a better place. So am I. So are you. Hey, we all carry the city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationships. Eh, nobody's here. Yeah. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under. I don't even understand why you chalk it, to be honest. Okay, imagine. This is me. It gets on the ball, you know. And these are Wait, all the, my the, go, the ball gets dirty. I actually hit it when it gets on the ball. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. For some reason, you chalk it. We had a pool table at my house one time, okay? I make them all move. I want to keep it. I can't remember if I was good, on it or not, good at it or not. Because even if I did play, I can't remember if I ever was good at it. <laughs> uh, I did play, but I can't That's remember if I was I good at it because it was so long ago that I had that pool table. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light. I'm 
only talking to you because Harvey asked. Trusting a friend to know what's best for God. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand the situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. Whatever you see. You're a good kid. You look like him, you know? It's nice that we understand each other. So I'm gonna play for now. I'll see you guys in the next episode, in the next video. <laughs> Sayonara.